Hello everyone. In present video, I will continue a discussion on Nicholas Lohmann's uh, system theory. So, as I said in the previous video, that Lohmann wanted to develop his own approach in the sociology and wanted to uh, wanted to make a new direction to sociology. So basically, Lohmann criticized or opposed the classical sociology or the classical sociological theories and thinkers. According to him, sociology is uh, suffering from the theoretical crisis. <clears throat> there is sociology lacks a general theory. Sociology lacks general theory of the society, general theory of the uh, social uh, social there is general theory of the social uh, aspect of any any of the reality any phenomenon anything in the society so there is no such general theory or there, there is no such general uh, theory of the system according to lohman the sociology is just engrossed in piling up all empirical data and making a complex the complex study with no direction that means he opposed the opposed the undirectional or uh, the confused or ambiguous uh, the compilation of the empirical data that is piling up of data what he said has no direction has no orientation and this is the main uh, source of the theoretical crisis in the sociology according to lohman sociology uh, should oppose this kind of empirical uh, empiricism or empirical data collection or compilation of the data or uh, revealing certain local insights instead sociology should uh, go for or should reveal or should uh, should uh, should set up certain conceptual framework on the basis of which a general a theory can be established a general theory of the society can be established so as i said Lohmann followed the Parsonian uh, or Talcott Parsons, the system theory, but he made his own understanding, own approach. And in order to, in order to get rid of Parsonian influence, he uh, turned to uh, he turned towards autopoetic system theory, and this autopoetic system theory we will discuss in other uh, video that is specific to this topic i will have and i will create a video but now i will discuss that's how lohman criticized the existing sociology and how he uh, diverted his, his theoretical orientation from the parsons system theory and parsons action theory and uh, what is his main theme or idea? Luhmann in his works or throughout his works never abandoned the idea of person that the social domain is a system by itself and that cannot be reduced to personality system that cannot be reduced to biological or physiological system. That social domain is social system by itself. So he never abandoned this idea, he never left, he never deserted this idea of person. But Luhmann wanted to refine personal, uh, personal idea of the system, personal idea of the social system. Here Luhmann was influenced by Humberto Maturana and Francisco Varilla's biological theory of the autopoiesis and that we said before. Luhmann uh, took the autopoetic turn to get himself free from the Parsonian influence and how he did it we will discuss later that this autopoetic system will be a uh, separate topic that I will discuss I will present before you one thing here has to be clear that Luhmann was aware about the reductionism of this biological theory so he had to get rid of this reductionism of Maturana and Barilla's autopoiesis. For that, he took the idea of the George Spencer Brown's theory of the uh, system as difference. So, system as difference, I will discuss 
in another video. So Luhmann basically opposed the uh, the classical structural functionalism uh, and particularly the structural functionalism of Talcott Parson. According to Luhmann, the structural functionalism of Parson uh, was incomplete, we can say, was incomplete in the sense that it was not able to reveal how social order can be maintained. It just focused on the maintenance of the social order, but it has not revealed how the social order is maintained. It just took some of the some of the ideas that on the basis of shared norms and values, the peoples are uh, attached, people are uh, means the reciprocal to the social structure and this is how social order is maintained. But it has not revealed the actual way of maintaining social order. <coughs> According to Lohman, the structural functionalism also lacks the idea of the constitutive the social system that is how social system uh, constitute and how the social system is different from the personality system and other the biological system it has not focused on this because Talcott person basically uh, considered social system as one of the aspect of the one of the aspect of the human action or individual action and he discussed social uh, system as one of the aspect that is uh, one of the three aspect so uh, what are the other two personality system and the cultural system so social system cultural system and personality system are the three different aspect of the human action or individual action that according to person and through this three type of system he presented how human beings or individual act in the society an individual action according to him is the basis of the social order individual acts according to the expectation of the society according to the shared norms and values of the society and this is how society maintains its order but according to Lohmann this is not sufficient because social system is different from personality system and biological system but person believes that the from personality system the social system and culture system emerges but here Lohmann opposed this very idea Lohmann says social system is different social system is unique social system has its own uh, own entity own features own uh, existence and his own essence it is different from personality system it is different it is different from cultural system so basically uh, lohman opposed the action oriented system theory of person and wanted to develop a general system theory by opposing and by by uh, getting relieved from the influence of person. According to Talcott person, the social system consists of the plurality of individual action and that action takes place in a situation that has a physical and environmental aspect. Again, this action and the situation is related to each other who has a relationship. So here individual has a motivation here individual is motivated to act in a particular situation. What is uh, this motivation? This motivation is to fulfill the needs and desire of the society. We can say the optimization of the gratification. That is optimization of gratification means the fulfillment of the desire of the individual actor as well as the expectation of the society. Because more, de more expression of desire if it violates the social expectation so it cannot be a social act. Again, it has to be also related to the desire of the individual actor. So, gratification, this uh, optimization of gratification that is there. So, basically thing is that this particular individual action is determined by the situation. And situation is built by, situation is built by the cultural system. Situation is built by the, the symbols. The, net, uh, the values, cultural norms, symbolic systems of the culture and this particular situation decides 
determines the individual actor. Individual assumes, individual is able to assume the situation accordingly. Here she acts. But here Luhmann believes that Luhmann believes that this social action is not the source of the personality system or social system. It's not the source of the emergence of cultural system and social system. Social system has its unique, has its own entity. It has to be discussed in more broader way. According to Lohmann, the action cannot be a suitable, the unit of the social system or unit of the society. Because according to him, the action should be replaced by the communication. According to Lohmann, action cannot be a suitable unit of for the for the development of general theory of social system. He wanted to replace action with the communication. Communication for him is the unity of the utterance, the uh, unity of the utterance, the information and understanding. And according to him, that is according to Lohmann, social action is not necessarily happens or occurs in the society. It may happens, that is action may happens even in the isolation. And the action may also be determined by the motivation of the individual. So action has to be replaced with the communication or communication must be used there is communication among various systems, communication between systems, and how individual action is the part of the communication. That is the main idea. So, according to Luhmann, social domain constituted as unique reality, unique entity, or unique reality, or unique social reality, only through the communication process not by the social action, through the communication process. And communication according to Lohmann is the unity of utterance, information and understanding. So through this communication, social system uh, got its formation. That is formation of the social system occurs once the communication cup come up, once the communication set up and uh, communication uh, maintains it is different from the action. According to Lohmann, action has a limit. Action has a limit. Action may be uh, based on certain personal motivation and action may not continue. Action may not maintain continuance. But the communication maintains the continuance. The continuance from one situation to another situation, from one system to another system, and continuance within the society. And because of this communication among all the systems, among the systems, the society maintains. Society maintains its existence, its entity. So communication is the continuation or communication is the continuance, continuance uh, process. It is different from the social action. Uh, it is different from the action. Action may be of different activity of the individual or the human individual, which may be related to society or may not be, which may be related to any social situation or may not be, which occurs in a particular social situation or in any private situation. But communication, communication mainly occurs, exist uh, to maintain the social network, to maintain the social reality prevails. So it would be not fair or it would be unfair to say that the social system derived from the social action according to Lohmann. That means Lohmann is a theorist who is more concern about or who deals with the social structure and social system. That is how individual action locates within the social structure and social system. 
according to him social structure uh, that is social structure of the social system means the manages by itself and that we will discuss in the later video that is autopoetic turn so that we will discuss so it manages by itself the system manages by itself and the structure of the system uh, is the basis of the society so in next video we will continue the discussion and thank you very much for watching